Wife and two, two children. Kids. Yeah. Thirteen and fifteen. So one's just in high school. The other one's uh, getting ready to go in high school next year. So uh, for them, it's you know it, it was a traumatic situation. Um, and and when uh, my wife and I first told them about it, of course, uh, you know they were very worried. You know, crying and stuff. And and uh, but uh, they've seen you know the progress. So. That's good. I had had some issues and uh, was diagnosed through colonoscopy with uh, colon cancer in January. Without uh, having medical insurance at the time, of course that's the big story of the day now. Then in June I had uh, surgery um, to uh, take out a stage two on the uh, colon cancer. Just then, uh, you know, an ordeal. So now I'm in about the middle of uh, the final round of chemo. Which is the Cancer Care Foundation got involved uh, as I was seeking assistance uh, and it's been uh, tremendous. I can't thank the foundation enough for the assistance that's been provided to me and, and indirectly with my family. Most specifically with the Cancer Care Foundation uh, Came to came to really pitch in and, and really help us as a family. Um, I work seven days a week. I'm used to working, and, and that's what I do. Uh, managing a store, um, we're limited to you know a certain amount of income, and for me to not be there uh, through the course of uh, the surgery, I was at the hospital for nearly a week, and as a result, um, we were provided with some assistance while I was out. And that was just a tremendous value to my family and I. I mean, it really helped us to stay even keel. It made the difference between us staying level um, where we are and, and need to be and, you know, and taking care of our family. The, the difference just kept us a lot smoother. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, I'd still be struggling even more now. Mm -hmm. and, and for that, I really appreciate it. It takes, it takes some of that stress off your back. You know, and, and uh, you know, financial burden, it, you know, that's like throwing gasoline on the fire. When, and, the, you know, it's enough of an emotional roller coaster just surviving, you know. So um, without that benefit of what Mercy and the Cancer Care Foundation and other people with the Colon Cancer Alliance have provided to me and support, talking to me, helping me with stuff, um, that's made the difference for me to just say, okay, I'm going to do what I got to do. You want to cut? Go cut. And, you know, they, they say that attitude is a lot of, of getting through this. And so with my uh, carrying through with this and the help that I've had and the support that I've gotten through it, um, that helps me keep the rest of the family in, in tow that, hey, we're going to continue on. And that's what we're going to do.